but the three best teams will walk away with a medal now in which order if you Let's wanna, find out if you want to watch this action on tv by the way you can check it out in spain on rtve and in france you can watch it on l'equipe just in case give you another option to check out this incredible action it is the gold medal game from here at kaiser visa square in vienna Ooh, you cannot miss that spoiling dessert you gotta lay on the table the cake without dropping it. Oh, he get a V day. Doing the same thing. Yeah, a couple of missed layups for each team. By the way, Kyle Montgomery, aka the voice of 3x3, in your ear right now with Angelo Zakarakis, the czar. Big time is Droge getting to the crib. So funny to me because Droge and Chameleon pretty much have the same profile. They're the same players with the same role on each team. All oh, the two veterans, the two legends going at it. And that time it's Igeravide schooling Mary J. Page. Oh, they're going to go at each other. They got, a, they got a track record. They know each other very well. And it's about bragging rats right now, Kyle. Well, you got Page, who's a two-time European champion already, a world champion as well. You get a V-Day does not have that world title, but she does have a Europe Cup gold and an MVP. So back at it, they go. I'll take that back. Transitioning, oh, great defense. On, yes. Beautiful. Defense turns to offense. Millipede will convert. There you go. On her first one-point attempt. That's a good sign for France. Kimeno using that quickness. Man. What touch on that layup. Oh, you can't be careless with the transition pass milby oh. makes up for it with a nice mid-range touch milby out of the blocks fast for france two for two on her first couple of attempts yeah got a whistle up top and that's going to be against france their first foul in a 3-3 tie in this gold medal game you're watching the fiba 3x3 europe cup 2024 ladies and gentlemen presented by win today don't wait for tomorrow gotta win today if you want to be a gold medalist the time is now. She brought her sewing kit. Watch her thread the needle. La Reina setting up that last score for Espana. France got to be a little bit tougher with the small details right now. Noemi Brochon getting caught red-handed with two hands on Gimeno. And now the ball deflected by Igravide. Earning possession back for Spain. Got to watch out with those little mistakes. Igravide's pass deflected that time. Marie Millipi has it. She's focused. Cross-court pass, Brochon. Brochon on the move left, drop step, elevation, no. Use the glass. Gracia with the board to Jimeno. You get a Vide. Nobody's been able to stop her yet. And the only thing to stop that was some solid defense on the inside. Break up the setup attempt. Troquet. Nice pass, what nice a look. action. Ooh la la. C'est joli. How do you uh, know how to say perfect parfait? <laughs> it is, that's, that's right. right. Your French is getting better by the oh, second. He get a V-Day. Can you get as good as the spin move from Iguera V-Day, brother? I'm surprised she got her equilibrium still, getting dizzy with it. And a 5-4 game is the result. I like the pace in this game, Kyle. Two great teams battling, going at each other, fighting for that inch. Fighting for that advantage. Spain, European champions in 2021. France, European champions in, champions in 2022. Both countries with winning pedigrees. <laughs> that was a tough shot. Fading like my barber. I need a touch up. Do you? 5-5. Five, five. You look good, brother. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. A little scruffy around the neck region, but I'll deal with it. Yep, me too, man. <laughs> five, five. I'm looking unprofessional right now. <laughs> Joe Gay up top. Goes down to the basement. Bronchon. All fouled on the way up. You get a V-Day, gets whistled. On the previous one, Brochon lacked elevation. She did not play it tough enough. This time around, she's like, not going to do the same mistake. She went a bit harder, and she drew the foul. Hey, I like what I'm seeing from both teams. 
It's a great final. I hope you enjoy it, guys. Oh, without a doubt. From our seat, I keep saying it. Here we are. We're at the, the world famous Prater. A lot of people don't know that we were hosting the Europe Cup here inside a, a famous amusement park here in Vienna, the Austrian capital. And it has been fitting to call this tournament a roller coaster ride. <laughs> so many ups and downs and twists and turns and loops and route to get to this gold medal game. But if, if they didn't know Kyle, they know now because they're sitting even in the stairs. There is not one free seat in the house. Standing room only, a capacity crowd of 4,000. Yo, oh, love my. is a one and chameleon. She goes on and on and on. Spain in front by two. I knew you would love that one. I had to borrow it. Oh, I give it to you. When it's I my borrow gift. It, I never give it back. <laughs> Give it, no, gives it up. Chameleon, oh, you no. gotta be kidding me. Incredible. <laughs> so you're the type of guy when, when you borrow the mop, we gotta borrow the mop back from you. Oh my goodness, take another look. Look at this. At, first one. That's the first one. The second one was even better than that. And threw up one. a prayer, and it is answered. 9-5, Spain. Page, beautiful pass out. Miller P off the iron. You get a V-Day. Flies in for the board. Quick ball movement here from Spain. You get a V-Day. Over to Jimeno. Viva! Las Vegas. Can France recover? Only a six-point game. I don't say that lightly. It is a three-possession lead. Great footwork by Jorgay. France need to maintain their composure. Jimeno. Good defense. Great defense. All oh, better offense. Basket, Basket counts. counts. But I do believe Spain yeah. will be called for the foul. Yeah, pushing it back. Uh, pushing it back, but the basket does count. Basket counts. Look at Vega Kimeno. Can you contest any better? Uh, falling away. And a buttery soft touch. Jokay. You got to make those yeah, if she, you want to survive. She's been adamant about getting to the, to the cup. She's done a good job at it. Got to finish those. You get a V-Day. Oh, has it poked away. You get a V-Day, we'll give it up. One to shoot. Nothing from Gracia, but she sticks with it. Persistence will pay off. France in deep need of answers. The ball is going to be given back to Spain. French ladies getting popped in the face, uppercut it, shot to deliver. They don't know how to behave. They can't protect themselves right now. Well, we had, we were having a conversation before this game. Yep. As Chameleon nice. is blocked by Page, great timing. And what I kind of told you, I said, Spain are just in a rhythm right now. Oh, yeah. I mean, no denying that. And the chemistry yeah. and cohesion on this team is an, at an all-time high. It's a piece of beauty. And I, I thought they'd be a tough uh, tough assignment for France to oh. get a win here. And so far, no, de no denying that. My prediction is proven true. For sure. For sure. I just feel that if there's any team right now capable of shaking the tree a little bit, it is France. But... They are struggling. Think about the shot from Chameleon. Think about all those hustle plays from Team Espana. Might be a team of destiny, Kyle. It might be a team of destiny. But right now, they shining like diamonds. But they want to be shining with gold glitter. They are four minutes and 15 seconds away from doing just that. Vega Kimeno, turn around when I'm talking to you. <laughs> turn around when I'm talking to you. 14-6. Tough, great contest. At the desperation heave for Maria Paget. Kimeno, slow to get up. 
But another, we talk a lot about Sandra Igedevide. Make no mistake about it. When there is a Hall of Fame in 3x3, Vega Jimeno will be right there as well. Yeah, she has been an incredible player. One of the best passing bigs, yeah. quote unquote, in, in women's 3x3 history. And we already know what she looks like beyond that two point arc. Yes. Oh my goodness. One of two absolute proven greatest players in yeah. the history of the game. And he got a V and Commander. You know what that deal reminds me of? Because I'm going to go for skill set to skill set. Okay, give it to me. Young Marbury and KG. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Young That's Marbury and KG, tall, tall, but long, tough player in the paint that can um, come out and shoot from a distance. There's, he got a V-Day, nope. A guard that can just do it all, playmaking, scoring, and everything. And when I say everything, I mean everything. Got to hold on to those. Mary J. Paj is not going down. Not that time, whistle on the inside. 337 to go. Spain with a commanding lead. Looking for the second European title. Page being defended by Iga Davide. Droge drives, kicks Millipede. Got up to a hot start. And she has played a great final for France. That's foul on Jimeno. Oh, is the, uh, well, that's the fifth. Foul on Jimeno. Plus, Jimeno could have been warned for a delay of game. A lot of contact on both sides there. Yeah, Jimeno thing thought like, hey, how can you call the foul on me when I'm probably the one being fouled in first place? Well, deal with it, I guess. Well, arguing oh, with the official won't, won't do you any good. We both know that. Moving screen, Mila oh. P, not set. I guess the ball don't lie. The ball don't lie. Spain have scored, have doubled the scoring effort of France to this point in the game. Handoff action, nice pass out. Ooh, that would hurt. And it oh does. my goodness, she's got the magic touch. Lorena somehow, some way, getting that two ball to go down. Get up and get, get, get down. Look at the touch. Sometimes the, the ball just bounces your way. Spain seemed to be a team of destiny. Yep. Nearly won a gold in Paris three weeks ago. Nearly. Close game with Germany in that, uh, that gold medal final. Yes. They ended up taking silver, which is iconic and legendary as well. But now they want gold. Airmail. The ball did not touch the rim. 12-second nope. shot clock violation. Yep. The astute eyes of official Pedro and official Vesco. 2.40 to play. Can France somehow, somehow pull off an improbable Ooh. comeback? Now we have to shoot it. Now we're no good. Chameleon kicks it out. 227 left in this gold medal game. Gracia up top. He get a V day. Uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> Double dribble. The referee's pointing at each other like, You saw it, baby? Yeah, I saw it, baby. You sure, baby? Yeah, let's call it. And it did the movement at the very same time. I like the accountability for me, Gadavide. You know what she looked at ref, uh, official Pedro and said, She said, You're right. <laughs> You're well, right. Well, well, that was it's, easy, it's easy to be agreeable when it's so obvious. <laughs> <laughs> touche, touche. Good hustle, Miller B. Page Bottoms. Two minutes. Not a lot of time, but it's still enough time, unless, unless, unless. La Reina, she's got a two in the forecast, making it rain for Spain, 18 to eight. How about Team Spain? Man. Led by Sandra Igueta Vide from the outside. Knock it in, another two ball to pretty much put this one out of reach. It would take an absolute miracle for France to make a game of this. 
We've seen it in the, in, in the men's world uh, with Latvia, uh, particularly. We've seen it with Serbia in the past. Like, okay, 10 point lead is not something that is impossible. But when you see the mastery from Team Espana at this very moment, it's like inconceivable to imagine France making up the gap. You get a V there, Kimeno. No, that, not that time. Nice forward. Yep, Millipede gets it done. And Spain in foul trouble, cannot commit another foul. Cabinio wants to get it to Igedevide, two to shoot. Igedevide better get it up. Does she do it in time? I don't think so. No. So shot clock violation with a minute 22 to go. France needs some steals and they need some two-point daggers, Kyle. They need to run up the score no. like mad ladies. No, they, they need Olivia Pope. <laughs> and even she can't help in this situation. Where are you, Olivia? Long range miss. That's what you play for. The Europe Cup 2024. Jimeno. No, he get a V day, gets it back. Jimeno is still down. And Alonso de Arminio will get the score. This game is done, Kyle. Espana on top of the world in 3x3 women's basketball, silver medalist at the Olympics. Europe Cup champion for the second time. It is what it is. Iguera Vida Loca, the best player by far in this tournament. I mean, it's just masterful the way she's driven her team to success. But if you think of this team, it's been a quatuor. It's been four ladies doing their part at the right time, the way it's supposed to be done. Everybody bringing their skill set, bringing their A game. They're just unbeatable right now. Spain are the class of women's 3x3. You won't find an argument for me, and, and you'd have a hard time finding anybody else that would argue that fact right now. They are just playing at an incredible level. Even on the, the women's series as well. They won four or five women's series stops in 2024. A silver medal at the Olympics. They are two points away from winning a gold here in Vienna at this edition, this ninth edition of the Europe Cup. The defense has been suffocating. Pache to Droguet. Droguet lines up a two and is no good. Here's Igedevide. Kimano, no. Only 12 seconds left. <laughs> Don't stop believing with 12 seconds left. <laughs> Come on, DJ. That's just mean now. See? That's just, that's just mean. Hey, DJ need to chill, man. Come on, man. <laughs> chill, DJ. Talking about some don't stop believing. <laughs> this game's done. It's Last cooked. seven seconds. Page. Is it as cooked Won't as that? Thank you, eight. There is the final horn. They came. They saw. They conquered. I ain't saying they some gold diggers, but they ain't come here just to hold silver. Gold for Spain. 1911. They follow up a silver in the Olympics with a European gold. The second for Jimeno and Igueravide, the first for Gracia and Camillion. Congratulations, Team Spain, your 2024 European champions over France, who will take a silver this time around. One of the big questions is how much longer will we get to see these two legends play 3x3 and Igueta Vide and Jimeno. Some wondering if this is the cherry on top of an incredible career for them both. We're certainly hoping they keep playing.